Welcome, this is Dr. Bertalan Meshko, the medical futurist. I think one of the most exciting medical technologies out there is a vein scanner. Whenever we have written about this on any of the medical futurist channels, the feedback you have given us have always been around, wow, this is something we want to hear more about. But vein scanners used to be extremely expensive, simply unaffordable, even for the most advanced healthcare systems. But now, here is one a pocket-held vein finder system. The package says it's accurate and efficient, safe and convenient. Of course, why not? So let's see what the package contains. A skin marker, a user manual, of course, power cables, and the device itself. There, is, there are two more things here, a remote controller and I guess a puzzle. No, <laughs> I think it's for uh, standardizing the device. So this is what a Wayne scanner looks like. It's uh, not really heavy. It's, I would say it's light and that the company said it works in a really easy way, a really simple way. You just have to click on the power button and then the magic is going to happen. <laughs> well, actually, based on the description in the user manual, before the first try, I have to make sure the device is working in an optimal way. And this is what I have to do with that. for that. You can see that every single square must contain a patch and it means the device is working properly. So uh, fortunately, I haven't made any mistakes about it yet. The remote controller, I guess, helps phlebotomists and nurses get a better view at the Wayne. Plus, I know that you can choose from uh, six different LED lights to make sure that the device works with any kind of skin tone or skin color, depending on the patient's uh, own features and characteristics. And this way, the company says, this device is not replacing nurses and phlebotomists, but this device can contribute to those professionals making even better decisions when it comes to finding the right way. For some people like myself, it has been an easy task for nurses around me, but in some cases with some patients, it's a really complicated task. So any technology that is still affordable can contribute to the process would be a great addition to the range of medical technologies we have been using already. If you like this video, please subscribe below so you will get notified about all the videos we come up with. Plus, please check out the digitalhealthcourse.com, the platform where you can learn all the things around digital health and the future of healthcare.